Hey, Michael. David. Well, isn't this nice? You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry, guys. This bar and hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> Brilliant! Steve Haynes, amigo, but you probably knew that already. Sorry, your name tag must have fallen off. Oh, <laughs> duh! I love it! I, I gotta remember to write that down. <laughs> and to shoot you in your head, you annoying dick. <laughs> Andreas, taking notes? This stuff? Whoa! Pure magic. I should put it on my show. Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third-rate country club? <laughs> so, well done with our uh, our friend, Mr. K. My pleasure. Uh, I love helping our government wage war, especially with itself. But you made a mistake. Did I, Cupcake? Why don't you keep your fucking voice down before I close your fucking windpipe? The joke stopped now, pal. You will show me and my team some respect. Maybe you could define team for me. Is that just the three of you? Or the greater FIB? Or the entire government? Because I'm tempted to argue that thus far, we haven't shown a lot of your colleagues a whole lot of respect. Then why don't you start with me, genius? You got it, pal. We have received intel that they're keeping Mr. K at the local agency station. I just dealt with that guy. The agency is stepping up their questioning because of your moronic antics down at the coroner's office. We need to get him out of there before he blabs. I did what Agent Norton said. Then I guess you getting involved with a clapped out old agent who's been living off of past glories was your first mistake. You are my boy now, amigo. Oh. My career depends on this. And that's very important to me. So seeing as we're all boys now, that makes it important to you. Now run along, kids. See, there you go, Dave. Can't teach an old dog new tricks. Let's go. We need to get to Covington Engineering Supplies off El Rancho Boulevard, that okay? No, none of this is okay. I'll rephrase that. Do I need to hit you over the head and drag you there? I can drive. Good, because I think I herniated a disc lugging you the other day. Yeah, small consolation. Tell me, Davey, you expense this ride to the taxpayer? Call Franklin Clinton. Tell him to meet us at the lot. Franklin who? Don't drag this out. He's in your crew. We know that. We need him. Unless he'd like his gangbanger buddies to know he's friends with the Fed's favorite CI. Fine. I'm calling. Hey, man. I'm kind of busy right now. What is it? That thing we talked about. It's happening. Some lot off El Rancho. Quick. Shit. Okay, man. Then I guess I'm on my way. I'm already in East L.S. Yeah, I'm sorry, Frank. Anyone else? No. We got you, Franklin, Trevor Phillips. That should be fine. Trevor? Are you really that stupid? He's waiting there. I had him picked up. The kid from your crew is gonna play lookout. Phillips is gonna fly you in. And you're gonna rappel down into the IAA station and extract Mr. K. Jesus. Trevor? Trevor! You keep him close, you keep an eye on him. And he knows I'm in with the FIB. You struck a deal. You watch him. I'll try to keep out of sight. Yeah, you do that. You know what? You better keep a low profile. Yeah, I think I will. See you later. Who's that cagey motherfucker, huh? No, it's another cagey motherfucker, all right? Not you! Hey, T, enough with the faux political bullshit! <sighs> Franklin, come on, you better take off. Really. Shit, I'm good. I ain't bailed. Whoa. What, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen, 
If you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. Like I said, Franklin, deranged. Yeah, and best friend. <laughs> exactly. That's Trevor, my best friend. That's Franklin, the son I always wanted. <sighs> all right, guys, listen, this is the shot. I'm gonna do all the heavy lifting on this job, okay? Trevor, all I need you to do is fly me to the target. Franklin, you're gonna cover me from across the street. We're gonna make these assholes happy, and we're gonna walk away from this thing clean. Got it? I got you. All right. And we do this, and they help us spring Brad, right? Yeah. We'll talk about Brad later, all right? I gotta change. You better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. <sighs> yeah, whatever. <sighs> The government gimp at last. Eh, yeah, bite me. Let's go. <sighs> All right, let's do this. We need to go to the agency headquarters downtown. Your new friends are a riot. No wonder you said sayonara to the old crew. Walking away ain't easy, Trev. But sometimes I guess you gotta make compromises. What happened to dying with a gun in your hand? Life happened. Annoying wife. Two kids. Remember them? You get tied down, you can't move anymore. What about your ties to me? To Brad? Those ties are why you got roped in on this FIB instigated suicide pact. For as long as it keeps me amused, I am. I ain't exactly sure it's gonna be amusing. We'll see. You know, you had me at suicide pact. I'm going in on the west side of the tower. Get us in position. I'll drop. West side. Hello. You fuck around while I'm out there. I'll climb back up this rope and strangle you with it. Yeah. Next, I'll have this thing so far up your ass, your tonsils will be playing shadow puppets. You think we can't do that? We can. It's in our guidelines. I don't know what you're talking about. I install cinema equipment, not surveillance. Grab his other arm. No, 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 no. You think you're impenetrable? No, no, no. See how you feel when this is 18 no. inches deep inside. No. Get the lube. Action. No. What the fuck is this? Terminate him. Close this problem right now. Yeah, I can use a little backup here. Damn it! This thing. 36 flow. I got you. Hey, I doubt you. You prejudice. Come on, man. Wait. Oh shit! Hold on. What the hell is going on? We got a window, T. Pull us out. They're extracting the asset. Left! Ow! We need the asset in T, we need to be clear of this building. There's guys shooting at you, Mikey. That's unfinished business. Clean it up. We'll move on. You damn softy. You're gonna get us killed, you know that? That's it. Get us out of here. Roger that! Whoa. Whoa. Looks like we've attracted the attention of their air unit. You got a bogey coming at you, Franklin! I thought I had the easy job. An attack on U.S. government agents is an act of war. We are clear to engage you. Hey, give me some sense. Hey, I'm clear over here. Nice one, kid! Within immediately, or your aircraft will be forcibly grounded. <laughs>
are you people? That doesn't matter. They said they were government. I do home theater. I'm not a... I don't care who you are. Then why are you doing this to me? <laughs> hey, hold tight. I got some friends with the Bureau. They'll explain everything. You saved me. Thank you. Thank you. Don't mention it. The Bureau. The FIB. They will make everything okay. Put her down in the lot, Trevor. Thank you. Oh, you saved me. Hey, hey. No, huh? No, 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 no. Hey, hey, I said easy. Oh, oh, come on, give the guy oh. a break. Uh. All right, we'll get out of this shit. Ha-ha! <laughs> In bed with the Bureau and a new running buddy. Yeah, he's more of a protege. Yeah, what, you gonna teach him to be old before his time? Yeah, to never grow up. That seems like a good kid. Huh? Michael, uh, look at this, huh? New city, new set of problems, but the idiots, uh, they stay the same. Yep, I guess. All right, Trevor, I'll see you later. Oh, you better believe it, buddy. 